morning, guys. You know, myself and Caitlin, we've been having so much fun here at the Good Food and Wine Show's brilliant baking theatre. We literally have been baking up a storm. But we decided to come a little bit early this morning and show you one of the recipes we're going to be demonstrating around 11.45 this morning. So if you are in the area, come through to the Good Food and Wine Show and come support us. Come sit down, come see how we make beautiful, delicious Hatsuki slices. Caitlin, how much fun have you been having? It's been tons of fun <laughs> and it's been so special to meet all the expressive viewers. So Hatsuki slices, such a big part of our South African heritage and we're making this on Heritage Day. Absolutely. As South Africans, we love our sweet treats. And this is one of those really easy recipes. It's not as finicky as the Hatsuki tarts with all that lining of the pastry and everything. So what we need is we've got some corn flour over here, uh, some cake flour, some butter, baking powder, an egg, and we're going to be using our Salati caster snow today. So we're going to start off by creaming our butter and our sugar. And then we're adding our Salati caster snow. We're using the caster snow because it's got a finer texture, so it's going to dissolve nicely and make a nice crisp crust. So Caitlin, while we wait for the butter and the sugar to cream together, what is your top baking tip when it comes to making hats or cookies? What tip can you give to our viewers? Well, my tip with regards to hats or specifically is to use really good jam. So try and buy a jam from a, a taste neighborate or someone maybe that's given you a special bottle of jam that's going to make them really authentic and local and lacquer. Local and lacquer indeed. But of course, if you want the recipe, all you need to do is SMS the keyword Salati to 33728. We'll send the Pickle Bay shopping list together with a link to the recipe to your phone and you can make your own beautiful delicious hats on slices. With the butter and sugar creamed, simply blend together all the dough ingredients. Herzogis are of course named for General Herzog, who was SA's Prime Minister between 1924 and 1939. So, Caitlin, looking at this, do you think we have the perfect cookie dough? Yes, it's a perfect consistency. It's nice and soft. And now I'm just going to press it into a, a baking tin. You want it nice and even because you want a nice crisp base. Generously spread the apricot jam over the dough. Use the back of the spoon to even it. Then whisk together the egg whites okay, and sugar. <laughs> Come on, Ewan, put your back into it. So okay. it's, you see it's beautiful, it's glossy, the oh. sugar's all dissolved oh. into it. And now we're going to add our coconut in. You mentioned a tip or a trick when it comes to meringues. Yes. So my tip for meringue is you have to beat it to soft peak stage. Um, and you'll know it's soft peaks when you lift up the whisk and it makes a little flop. The meringue flops over like that softly. So now it's going to go in an oven at 170 degrees for about 30 to 35 minutes until it's beautiful golden brown and crispy. Delicious. Can't wait. Here's a quick recap. Cream the butter and caster sugar until light and fluffy. Then beat in the egg, baking powder, flowers and salt. Press into a lined baking tin. Whisk the egg whites to soft peaks, then beat in the caster sugar and fold in the coconut. Spread the jam on the pastry and top with the meringue. Bake at 170 degrees Celsius for 30 to 35 minutes until golden. Caitlin, look at that. Are you proud? I am proud, and it's a perfect way to celebrate Heritage Indeed Day. Indeed it is. Of course, SMS the keyword Salati to 33728. We'll send you on the shopping list as well as a link to the recipe to make your own Hatsuki slices on this lovely Heritage Day. And we're looking forward to see you in the audience. Remember, 11.45, pull through. We would love to meet and engage with you. Now, back to you guys at studio. Mm. <laughs> mm. The sweetness lingers longer with another delicious recipe brought to you by Salati.